there, this is Stacy Phillips and this is my video log for Thursday, August 29th, 2013. I think it's August 29th. I hope it's August 29th. That's what day I thought it was. Um, anyway, today is Thursday. That, that I do know. Um, today I wanted to talk a little bit about a, a real milestone that's coming up in um, our family's life uh, in two days. Actually, by the end of the day tomorrow... Uh, my husband will have been home uh, for a full year homeschooling our boy as um, his primary, you know, job, responsibility, etc., etc., etc. So um, I am so thrilled. And our son has just finished his first grade curriculum. I think he has just a day or two left, actually, of his first grade curriculum. And then he'll start right into his second grade curriculum. So um, I don't know if my husband watches my vlogs, but honey, I just wanted to let you know how much I appreciate um, this adjustment that we've just all made. Um, we had to pull my son out of uh, school last year because um, having had a kidney transplant five years ago, successful kidney transplant uh, five years ago when he was three and a half, just the, you know, a year and a half ago, we were just seeing that he kept getting sick. Um, being on immune suppression medication, which he'll have to be on for the rest of his life. For some reason, he had been okay in um, preschool half day. He'd been okay in kindergarten half day. Uh, we had him in a small Christian school, and the you know the teachers were amazing, and the aides were amazing, and they were all amazing. So I'm not sure um, really what happened the the next year that he was in um, full day kindergarten. Um, you know, same teacher, uh, just as conscientious aid. Um, I just not sure, um, but he just started getting. Just, I said just as conscientious of an aid. We didn't have a, a less conscientious aid. Um, the school was wonderful, and um, they did everything that they could to keep him healthy. But for some reason, he just um, had four illnesses just knock him right out four in a row. Um, that first semester, starting with strep that he contracted the day day one. That had him out for two weeks, and then he went back, and he got, um, he got, uh, the next one was the croup that he got. Um, after that came um, pneumonia he had, and then a tummy virus that uh, lasted um, three months for him. Um, for all, all the other kids with healthy immune systems, you know, non-suppressed immune systems, it, you know, lasted three days, and they were back in class, because it just went through the class like wildfire. Um, but for my son, he was out for three months with, um, you know, severe gastrointestinal issues. And so recovering from that, um, and that's when we made the decision to pull him home. Um, and I tried to homeschool him for a whole semester, but even though I had the time, uh, with my, um, my mission, my calling, my, you know, my work um, that I do, helping people get healthy. I, I, I did have the time uh, to homeschool him, but I, I really, we came to the um, very solid uh, um, decision that I lacked other skill sets that were necessary to um, really effectively homeschool an eight-year-old boy. <laughs> so at that time, we decided, actually he was seven at the time, but we decided at that time that we will do everything we would do everything we could to bring my husband home um, from a wage earning job, uh, bring him home uh, so that he could homeschool Julian because that was just the next um, necessity. We, we, in our family, we make a lot of decisions based on the necessities of our son and, and, and we organize our lives around what matters most to us. And really it was just the next logical step. So uh, Dave came home almost a year ago. Um, day after tomorrow. Well, he came home a year ago, a day after tomorrow, if that makes sense. And um, our life has just changed so dramatically. I mean, I, I'm so grateful. I'm so thankful. Um, I'm just, I just feel so blessed that, that we can do this. Anyway, so this vlog is not necessarily a, a kind of an encouragement of your journeys. It's just kind of a report about our journey this last year. And I just wanted to, um, to quickly say, um, you know, this was my husband, and he's also he's also a health coach. He talks to the dudes when they want to talk to dudes. So um, there's my husband. He lost 50 pounds. 
And at the bottom there it says um, results vary. Clients can expect to lose two to five pounds um, for each of the first two weeks and then one to two pounds thereafter. But he lost 50 pounds and there he is. Um, hot food there. And then here's um, another picture of he and I. Kind of a glary picture, sorry about that. But these are us with our puffed faces. Um, both pretty much at our high weights. Um, and then here's my darling boy. That was a picture of him in his school shirt uh, when he was, I think, in uh, pre-K or the kindergarten half day. I think it was kindergarten half day there. But he is now um, eight, and he'll be nine in about a month. And our birthday trip to him is a trip to Atlanta to see his kidney doctor who transferred over there uh, from Tucson. So that'll be a fun trip. Anyway, I wanted to wish you all a happy day, and we'll see if my husband actually uh, watches my vlogs. Thanking him and appreciating him on this vlog. Don't you guys, don't you guys email him either. He's got to come on this one himself. <laughs> Have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.